up YouTube and what you know my name is Domino with Zero and welcome back to Pokemon Crystal the completely randomized Nuzlocke episode number 12 that is correct uh, in the last episode we took on Whitney the gym leader of Goldenrod City Gym and Whitney proved that she was the strongest gym leader in Johto you'll see what we do in a second when we do our team recap if you missed the last episode um, but you should definitely check it out because tragedy struck our team like never before. Like I thought we were done for, I, I thought we were done for a little bit. Uh, make sure you definitely check that episode out. Um, and then, so today we're going to head north. We're going to head to Ecruteague City. Um, I'm not exactly sure how far we're going to get, uh, but we're going to go through the, uh, the, the park there. We're going to do the pseudo Wudo thing. I think we can make it to Ecruteague City today, as long as we don't mess around and die. Um, anyway, Scott, or Liz, calling us, as she always does. Before I go too far, actually, I just said we were going to do a team recap. Okay, do I have money? Okay, here's what we're going to do. So first thing we're going to do is run up, whoa. We're going to run up here, and we're going to sell some stuff. So what can I sell? Okay, I can sell TM for Rain Dance. Sure. I'm gonna go ahead and buy, how many super potions do I have? I have seven. Let's buy like, what, what, what's the cost of eight? Is that most of my money? That is the most of my money. Uh, so what, I have seven, is that what I said? So I'm just gonna buy three. And we're gonna run around here. And I only had five of these, can I buy 10? wonderful okay so let me get out of here and then we'll do our team recap i know i'm kind of all over the place right now so here is our team recap <laughs> Woo! all right first up in our team recap is drago the ground type diglet uh who is the smallest member of our team with vice grip ice beam aurora beam and flame wheel he's holding the amulet coin amulet coin however you want to say it uh, because we need to get some money. His stats are looking okay, especially his defense and his attack. Next up is the red card of our team, the strongest member of our team, as she's always been. That's Sarah, the grass poison type Dragonite. She has scratch rolling kick, dizzy punch, and low kick, still holding the amulet coin, the amulet coin, whichever it is, because we need money. And stats are pretty good, especially that defense and special defense. You will not hear me complain. And last on our team is uh, Clovis, the most frail member, the flying type Swinub, with Sludge, uh, Overpowered Cut, Boomerang, and Mud Slap. With okay stats minus that speed. So, again, if you're curious about what in the world happened to our team, check out the last episode. There should have been a card up in the top right corner. How do I do this? Top right corner, that way, right there. Should have been a card. Um, that you can go to the last episode and check that out. <sighs> it was tragedy, it was tragic. So we're gonna lead with Drago. And there's a whole lot we can do today. So first things first, is we're gonna stop in here. Little sister got all excited and went to see it. I'm worried, isn't it dangerous? Wait. Okay, cool. So here, there's, a, there's so many Pokemon that we can get. First off, and I should have done this before, if you talk to this guy, couldn't you do a guy a favor? Can't you take this Pokemon with mail to my friend? He's on Route 31. You will? Perfect, thanks kid. My pal's chubby guy who snoozes all the time. You'll recognize him right away. So we just gave us a Pokemon with mail on it. So we're gonna add this to our team. I'm gonna add this to our team. Let's find out what it is. It is Kenya. It's always named Kenya, and the last time I did a lock like this, uh, it was also a grass type. It better not be an Oddish. Alright, new to our team is Kenya, the poison type Sunkern. With expl- 
with Explosion, Ice Punch, Stun Sport, and Stomp. With awful stats. Yikes. Okay, so let's get into today's question of the day. As you can see, camera, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I know it's nighttime, but I'm right here. As you can see, I'm wearing a Power Ranger shirt, a nice powerful shirt. If I'm back here, you might think it's the Black Ranger shirt, but it's not. It's the Blue Ranger shirt. Can you see the logo? You can definitely see the logo there. Oh, oh wrong way. There you go. You can definitely see that trust there top there. So, did you ever watch Power Rangers? And who is your favorite Power Ranger? Now, here's the thing. My answer... <laughs> uh, my favorite... I'm scared. I I'm absolutely terrified. Alright, Drago. <laughs> Drago said no need to be worried. Mom! Found a useful item. Alright, let's run back. So, my favorite Power Ranger... I did watch Power Rangers, especially Power Rangers... Um, I guess when I was growing up, I watched Mighty Morphin Power Rangers all the way through, like, um... This has nothing to do with Pokemon, by the way. I was just trying to figure out what, uh... What? Oh. She got us a Super Potion. Thanks, Mom. Um... This is no nothing Pokemon related. I was just trying to figure out what the question of the day would be. Uh, so that's why we're, we're going with this. Um... So I watched all the way through, like, Dino Thunder for sure. And then, like, I might have watched something else that I don't, you know, I don't remember what was after Dino Thunder. I stopped watching. But, like, she bought another thing. We'll check it out when we go back. But um, when Twitch did the, uh, when Twitch re-showed all of Power Rangers, I watched a lot of that. Uh, and it was really nostalgic. So maybe my question should be like, okay, we're gonna change the question of the day. So if you've already done your question of the day, then you get to do two, which, suck it up. Um, why did I know it was gonna have extreme speed? I knew it was gonna have extreme speed. Slam, Jesus. Okay. Um, what was, like, your favorite show growing up aside from Pokemon? So, like, for me, I might say Pokemon, but Power Rangers would have been the next one. Oh, no, Digimon. You know what? I'm just going to continue to babble on about Power Rangers. Why not? I'm, I'm kind of feeling it at the moment. I know why I'm feeling it. I saw the, um... So my favorite Power Ranger of all time is the Green Ranger, Tommy. Uh, I think I think that's the, the case for a lot of people. Uh, let's go ahead and switch. Let's give Clovis... Oh god, this is so dangerous. This is so dangerous. We cannot lose a Pokemon. Okay. Um... So my favorite was definitely Tommy the Green Ranger. He was also my favorite when he was the White Ranger and the Red Zeo Ranger. So I loved him all the time. Uh, what's this guy's last mon gonna- oh god, I, I did the wrong move. Um. Okay, I gotta remember that. Parasect. Oh! We're gonna die. This is bad. And this guy's gonna challenge us. And then we can start catching some mods. What type was Meryl? Let's go ahead and switch. Let's just be safe. Baton passing out here? So we're, so we're going for actual strategy now. I see you. I see you. So, 
Um, where was I? Oh, so I saw the... If you saw the, the, the Power Rangers movie, the new one that just came out, uh, first off, I thought it was amazing. Uh, I thought it was absolutely great. Uh, I, I will definitely see it again when it comes out uh, on, like, uh, on, like, movie, on DVD, whatever you, whatever, whatever word I'm looking for. Uh, I'm talking to myself, forgive me. No! Come on, Clovis, hang in there. Uh, let's just use a super potion. That sucks to have to use a super potion like that. I guess I'm making money. All right, here's our first capture. An electrode. Okay, it doesn't evolve, which is kind of sucky. But uh, let's hit it with sludge. Clovis, now is not the time for this. Now is not the time to show off your power. Now is not the time. Oh my gosh. All right, what TM did we just get? Metal Claw? Okay. Metal Claw could be good. Could, a lot of people can learn it. We're okay for now, though. All right. Um, so... Oh, right, right, right. So I saw... Um, Jason David Frank, Tommy, and Amy Jo Johnson, Kimberly, did cameos in the new Power Rangers movie. And they did two of them, but only one of them made it into the actual film. Uh, so today I saw... Uh, I saw the first... Uh, what am I trying to say? I saw the first cameo that they did even though it wasn't shown in theaters they showed it uh i think i think uh jason tommy posted it on uh facebook we got a muck okay muck is powerful now clovis no here use bone meringue okay use the ancient power Okay, let's go ahead and switch out. Let's go to, um, let's go to Drago. And then let's go ahead and start throwing some Pokeballs. And like that, Muck is caught. All right, so I need to go on here and go to random name. Wait, do I have it open? Okay, so random name. No. Oh my gosh, what are these words? I'm doing a whole lot of random, uh, just mumbling today. Just going on and on and on about nothing. All right, first name only. Feminine. Okay, Muck, the sludge Pokemon. As it moves, a very strong poison leaks from it, making the ground there barren for three years. That's intense, that's intense. Muck's nickname is... These names, man. Zivia. We have Zivia, the Muck. Let's go ahead and check out our newest addition to the team. Zivia, the fire water type Muck with Snore, Rock Slide, Horn Attack, and Ancient Power, and pretty good stats overall. That's a good addition to our team if Rock Slide, Horn Attack, and Ancient Power are any good. So we'll do a grinding montage before the next episode and get uh, her up to par with everybody else. I could have had a Blastoise. That's pretty cool. Um, I kind of feel like switching. Let's let Sarah just uh, sweep through some people while we continue to talk about Power Rangers. Um, 
It does not affect. Psychic doesn't affect it. This Pidgey needs to calm down. Octazooka? Octazooka, huh? Wait, low kick is a ghost type move, which hasn't really come in too useful, so we'll go ahead and get rid of it. Um, let's see, what else can we talk about with Power Rangers? Did I even finish what I was talking about? So, Jason David Frank, Tommy, the old green, white, red rangers, and black ranger at one point, posted the first uh, cameo that they filmed for the movie on Facebook. So I think that got my kick of Power Rangers up. So um, this episode is just uh, all Power Rangers, apparently. Sarah! Thank you. We don't love these people. Remember that. We do not love them. We don't love them. And take on all these trainers. Scratch doesn't affect, so he must be a ghost. That's, I'd say that's a pretty good strategy right there. Blastoise would have been cool. I want to find something that can evolve. Not something weak that can evolve, but something that can evolve. Alright, Scratch does not do any damage. Maybe that should just be the, the result I come up with. Octazooka is also a ghost type move, but it looks like it hits more accurately than Low Kick does? Question mark? Could have had a Jolteon, that's pretty cool. Uh, okay, let's go this way real quick. DM10, and an energy root, okay. Kind of a waste. Well, I guess I haven't looked at what TM10 is. I'll look at it in just a second. Sharp beak. I think that's all the trainers. I think. I think that's all the trainers. So, um, what's TM10? Cross Chop. That's a pretty sick move. Zivia can learn it. Zivia, not Zivia. Zivia. Zivia can learn it. Okay. Let's go ahead and leave. How far? How close are we? All right, we're we're pretty close. I think we can go ahead and, and do what we had planned for the day. Okay, so a rock type move was not very effective, so I'm just gonna go. With... Okay, maybe that's not as a. All right, let's take on this guy. This game is absolutely crazy. He definitely just tried to use solar beam on me. I don't know why they do that. Wait, that's a new route? Oh, wait, no, 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 no. That's not a new route. That's a route that we've already been to before. That, that's actually where we caught Drago. Was on that route that we're on now. Um, let's come in here. Wait, what? Told my sis about the jiggly tree. She just told me it's dangerous. If I beat Whitney, I wonder if she'll lend me her water bottle. Okay, here we go. All right, let's go do this pseudo wudo event. <gasps> Celebes in the grass. That's so hype. Okay, so route 36 again up here. Uh, what? Camera, you can't do that. Man, I really hope it's been focusing most of the time. Camera, hey, I'm right here. Hi. All right. Let's see what this pseudo wudo is. Doesn't look like it likes the squirt bottle. The tree attacked. Hi-ya! It does evolve. 
All right, and it's level 20, so that's that's pretty good. Let's go with an Octazooka. No, let's go with the Scratch. It doesn't affect. Octazooka would be a bad idea. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Hey. Stay in the ball. Thank you. Thank you, horsey. That's an immediate addition to the team. Horsey, the dragon Pokemon. When they're in a safe location, they can be seen playfully tangling their tails together. You got it. And his name, her name, excuse me, is going to be... Magia. Oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I definitely saw that backwards. Magda! Or Medja. Ma Majda. Alright, let me go ahead and heal here in Violet City while we're here. And then we'll finish making our way to Ecritique City. Hmm. We are at 20 minutes. So actually, I was planning on going a, 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 a touch longer. But um, what we're going to do is we're going to stop right here. I'm going to go ahead and save, and we're going to call it an episode. Again, we're trying to keep these about 20 minutes long. I think that's about all we need to do for now. So, today, we... I mean, we didn't lose anybody. <laughs> that's a success, right? <laughs> it's a success in itself. Uh, we do need to check out Majda. Majda. Majda, the ghost-type horsey. With Protect, Submission, Dizzy Punch, and Tri-Attack. And pretty good stats. Look at that special defense. That speed and attack are pretty good. I guess it is already level 20, so that's kind of, I guess, what I should be expecting. Let me look at my... Oh, wait. Let's look at my other level 20s. I guess it's about what you should expect. So, um, for the next episode, I think we're going to train up to about level 20. That seems about good. Train, train everybody up to 20 or 21. Probably like 21. Um, so we can do some grinding and get some of the music in there because I like to find some new music. Um, if you have suggestions of music that I should listen to for Johto, make sure you let me know and link them to me in the, uh, in the comments. Um, but like I said, that is going to do it for today's episode. So in the next episode, we'll make it to Ecritique City. Um, we'll probably take on the Kimono Girls and then head up to the Burn Tower and see what, see what goes on there and meet a very interesting character that's only in Pokemon Crystal. So if you enjoyed today's episode, go ahead and hit that like button and show your support. It would be greatly appreciated. We just hit 50 subscribers over the weekend, in large part thanks to the MLPB. So if you're here from that, thank you so much. And if you've been here from the beginning watching these series, again, thank you so much. The support means so much to me. But we're on. We're moving on. We're moving on. We're going. This is just the beginning. We're just getting started. So I hope you're enjoying so far. Talk to me down in the comments below. Talk to me about whatever you want. Um, tell me maybe like what the first video was you saw of mine. Um, talk to me about Power Rangers. Whatever you want. I will respond to whatever is in the chat as long as it's not ridiculous. Whew. That's a lot of talking. We will see you guys tomorrow for another episode of Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke. Have a blessed day.